Maeve. Yes? I'm really curious, why on Alternia did you become a school counselor? I mean, you could've opened your own e-shop, you could've opened your own shop, to sell your little embroidery patches, or just not work and chill at home, because I'm the breadwinner, so, why a school counselor? It was the only job I could find. I guess that's fair. Han, did you really have to abandon the behavior card system? The old one was much better. We are not executing children for simply having bad behavior, nor are we expelling any of them. And the fact some cards gave children the option to graduate, hell no. How will they become functioning adults if they get to just leave school forever? I still prefer the old one. Well, I'm the principal. I make the rules. Does the huffy pup enjoy his big boy job? Not out in public. Hush yourself. I'll be in my office. Works every time. Ms. In Rosa, I feel sad and hopeless, like it seems every turn it's just disappointment after disappointment. I only have one friend who constantly does bad things that get me in trouble. I know I do bad things but I do them because of my dad's genes, but I don't like the consequences. I hate getting grounded and I hate punishment days, you'd think after so many years of this stupid cycle happening, my parents would know I won't become better. I want to be better but how do I possibly be better? Simple, kill yourself. Wah, what? It's clear to me you can't handle what life has to offer you. If you can't expect to handle the consequences of your actions, I believe simply killing yourself is the way to solve it. I, you, Ms. In Rosa, are you sure you're supposed to tell students that? What's the principal going to do? Fire me. If you don't want my advice then perhaps you should hire a professional therapist. I don't get paid to deal with your woes. Yeah, I'm going back to class. Love, are you busy? No, I'm not. Is there something you need? Did you tell one of our students to kill themselves? Well, if the little human says he can't handle what life has to offer, then he might as well die. Honestly, humans claim life is hard for them, but I bet you if they spend one day on Alternia, that tune will change. Maeve, we do not tell the students to kill themselves. Next time a student comes to you about their mental and emotional issues, just redirect them to Ms. Leanne. As you wish. Good. I don't know, Ms. and Rosa. It seems no matter what I do, Doran always thinks I am trying to worry up her. For example, we were answering Mrs. Christina's question on math. It was a simple one too. What's 9 plus 10? Doran answered with 21. I'm guessing it's a meme. Mrs. Christina didn't like that, so after that, she called on me and I answered with 19. Then Dora got angry at me for making her look dumb. I tried telling her that she purposely got the answer wrong, and I'm not joking with you. She genuinely thought 9 plus 10 was 21. What do I do Miss Dan Rosa? I see I see. You know, usually when there's someone who constantly hates everything you do, they're romantically interested in you. Um, no, no. I'm sure it's platonic paint, and besides, I'm sure she's not into girls. Ah, well in that case, perhaps you should just execute her. Um, I'm a pacifist. Sometimes we need to sacrifice our own beliefs to sustain a more comfortable life. I think I'll just ask Miss Leanne for advice. Thanks. I mean alright, deal with the destructive child then. Maeve, I've gotten word about what you've told young Miss Delgado. Is simply telling her the truth a problem? Humans, especially these young ones, do not understand our romantic quadrants. I would recommend you don't discuss such a thing with them. Their parents can do that for them. And I've already told you to not tell the kids to kill themselves, or one another. Are you telling me how to do my Your job? Yes, I am. A school counselor is supposed to encourage the students and help them achieve, and they can even help with preventing youth suicide. You're doing none of them. You can blame the Boris human for hiring me. That explains how you got the job. Just please try to be more encouraging. I know you don't like children, but for God's sake, fake it. And if I don't? Then you better start applying for another job. You wouldn't fire me, would you? You're so mean. Okay, I'll be more encouraging. Thank you. I don't know. I just hate everyone so much. Everyone in the stupid school. I hate my teacher. I hate my classmates. Especially Gina. 
and I just hate this whole school in general. Sometimes I wish I could just grab the gun and just kill everyone. Is it platonic hate? Yeah, very much. Um, him, I understand. Sometimes you need to take those dreams and thoughts and make them a reality. Why let those ideas just be ideas and not do anything with them? Don't be afraid to achieve what you desire. Yeah, do you think so? Of course. Yeah, yeah, okay. Thanks, Ms. Rosa. She seems happy. I've simply done what you wanted and encouraged her to achieve her dream. See, I knew you could do it. I'm very proud of you. Thank you, hun. Anyways, what brings you here? I've been thinking about it and I want to tell you I'm sorry for how I spoke to you. Oh, don't worry about it. You're just doing your job. You're just trying to make the school better for everyone. I'm glad you understand. Thank you. Man, this is boring. I hope something happens soon. Sir, we need to get going now. Why? What's going on? We just got alerted of a shooting in the Go City Elementary. Finally, some action. Let's go fill someone with bullets. How on earth could this have happened? I'm not sure. We're going to bring Dora in for questioning later. Are the kids okay? Did any of them survive? We did a whole sweep and it seems she got everybody. Oh my god, I think I'm going to be sick. Huh, I guess encouraging students does work. What? Oh yeah, she was going on about how she hated everyone and how she wanted to kill everyone. So I told her she shouldn't let her ideas be ideas and... So you convinced her to shoot up my school, kill my student? You said to encourage them. Maeve, the second she even made a comment about her idea, you shouldn't have reported it straight to me. Did her saying how she wanted to kill everyone not bring up a red flag? Death is something we've seen every day Giovanni. Why is this upsetting you? When I spent my limited time down in the brooding caverns, grubs died all the time. This isn't all Ternia Maeve. Killing innocent lives has consequences. If 100 babies died right now, everyone would be upset. Boris, why on God's green earth did you approve Maeve to be school counselor? Well, I needed someone to keep those kids in line. If they knew she was here, they wouldn't act up. Boris, you? I just... Oh my God, I can't. Giovanni, it's not a big deal. They'll just respond. Zip it, young lady. I do not want to hear another word out of you until we get home. Respawning is one thing, but that respawning will come to all that trauma. Get in the car. Giovanni, I don't appreciate your tone. It's my job to protect you, but also keep you in line. And this whole ordeal happened because you are incorporating alternian culture into Earthian society. I don't care how you feel about my tone or attitude. You will do, as I say, and get in the damn car. As you wish. Not only do I have multiple families to inform, I have to get everything cleaned up. The time, the money. Boris, what do I do? Well, I can tell you exactly what to do. You should just go home. There's nothing else you can do. We will get everything sorted out. We will tell the families. And I will give Dora a five-day long torture session for killing my children. Right, right. I'll be going home then. Come in. Can we talk? We can. We haven't been on this planet for long. The mindset of Alternia culture is still fresh in our heads, and it's drastically different compared to culture here on Earth. And I understand it's hard to learn the ways of a new culture, and I had no right to speak to you the way I did about it. I can give every excuse in the book for why I did, but not one will excuse what I said. I'm sorry, Maeve. I don't believe you need to be. Maybe you were right about firing me. No, I'm not doing that. I will not fire you over still holding on to our culture. It will take time for us to be more indulged in Earthian culture, and learn what's right, and what's wrong. For now, Boris has told me we don't have to report to the school for a few weeks, maybe a couple of months, whenever he feels comfortable opening it back up. What should we do then? I've taken a week off from all the stress I've been dealing with. That means we get a whole week to be alone? Yeah, what did you want to do? Bring me some tea and maybe I'll forgive you. Hey, alright, 